Hello and welcome to this channel. Uh, today we are going to look at the lookup and reference functions. Specifically, I'm going to look at filter and group by. So we'll start with the group by. For example, in this data, I want to group my data by year and I want by amount. I know this you can use sum if you can use a p4 table or any other uh, applicable function but the group by function is an array function that will check the rows and sum for you whichever column that you want but since we don't have the year for this shipping date i'm going to use the year function to create a new column called the year so this is the year then i'll type is equals to year and pick the date which is this and then enter. So I'll have the year there. Now in my new uh, sheet, I'm going to type is equals to group by. So the group by function has the row fields, which is the, the, the column that you want to group, the values, that is what you want to sum, and then the function. Then optionally, you can have the field headers, total depth, uh, depth sort order, filter array, or fill relationship. In this video, I'm going to only focus on the row fields, the values, and the function. So for this case, I want to group by the year, which is column O, comma, I want to sum the amount, which is column N, and then invoke the function sum, and then close the brackets and press enter. This will group per year, so this will be the year and this will be the amount and then the total column there so i can change this change this to um, add a thousand separately like that so i have it and then i can click here and ignore the error now secondly the filter function allows us to create even more custom reports for example if i wanted to create a custom report plus the records of that report you could come here and say, for example, I want to filter only, I want only a report for Kenya. So for this case, I want to pick the country column, paste it here, and then remove duplicates. Data, then remove duplicates like that, and click OK. Now I have four unique countries, but I want this to come down as a drop down. So I'll pick another sheet, then type here country. Then I'll have a drop down to come from data validation, list, and then the source will come from sheet two, which is the countries. Then I click OK. Now I have my country there. Now, should I need only records for the country Kenya, I can use the filter function. So I'll start, I prefer to start here. But before I do that, I need to have the headers. So I'll pick the headers, which is in row number one, copy, and then paste the headers here. So I'll paste the headers here, and I'm going to leave it like that, or just increase the size a little, um, like this. Filter function equals to filter. And then pick my data, which is my array which is this, I can lock it with F4, then comma, I want the country data which is in column F. So I'll pick this like that, lock and say is equals to Kenya. So I'll pick the first country there and press enter. So it gives me only data for Kenya. If I change this to a new country, automatically the filter function is going to apply and give me the country. You can also use the advanced filter function to achieve the same thing with criteria. Thanks for watching.